How are things over in Hooterville, Ben? Oh, no sense complaining. Wally, haven't you found those applications yet? Nope. Well, what is that you got there? Mail, we haven't had time to open. Well, all right, then just file it in the unopened mail cabinet. <laughs> You know, we ought to read some of this mail they're always sending us from Washington. We get around to it one of these days. We, we get more mail from the Department of Agriculture than you can shake us up. Oh, here they are right here. Newt Kiley and Ben Miller. <laughs> <laughs> well, fellas, uh, the committee has gone over your application and we are raising your allotment for this year. You are allowed to grow 10% more wheat than you did last year. Oh... You see, we divided up the... Yeah, thing. Wally, do you mind? I happen to be the chairman of this here committee. You see, we divided up the Haney wheat acreage amongst you fellas. Of course, Haney didn't put in for his allotment this year. Oh, uh, Haney got rid of his farm. Finally gave up. No, no, some city feller named Douglas bought it. The Haney place? Maybe you ought to talk to Douglas before you raise our allotment. Yeah, he's figuring on farming it. The Haney place? <laughs> Quiet. Quiet. What did he say? He said, quiet. Well, then what are you yelling for? <laughs> now, before I introduce Mr. Douglas, who's starting all this trouble, I'd like to make an announcement. Mr. Douglas's opinions are his own and are not necessarily endorsed by Drucker's store. I'm just lending this place for the meeting. Mr. Douglas. Thank you. <clears throat> Gentlemen. <clears throat> Why are we gathered here tonight? That's what I want to know. We're missing Gomer Pyle. <laughs> well, we're gathered here tonight to protest a violation of one of America's... What did he say? <laughs> I said we're here... Grand Peppy, would you like to sit closer to me? No, I don't want to sit on your knee. <laughs> Grand Peppy, would you let Mr. Douglas talk? Uh, go ahead, Mr. Douglas. Uh, yes, thank you. Uh, where was I? Explaining why we're missing Gomer Pyle. <laughs> Wait, yes. uh, we're missing Gomer Pyle because we're here to right an injustice. Are we to be allowed to grow... Excuse me, Mr. Douglas. Who'd you say we're going to write to? <laughs> we're going to write to an injustice because... No, no, I mean... Uh, we are going to write an injustice. <laughs> Gentlemen, the question is this. Is our land ours to grow what we want to... Or are we going to have to grow what we don't want to because they don't want us to? I say no. Gentlemen, we are farmers. I have prepared a petition of protest. If we all sign it, we can make our voice heard in Washington. Well, they wouldn't listen to us. Mr. Kiley, may I refer you to the words of Ralph Waldo Emerson? Mr. Emerson said, By the rude bridge that arched the flood, their flag to April's breeze unfurled, here once the embattled farmer stood, and fired the shot heard round the world. Gentlemen, we too can fire that shot. <laughs> Mr. Douglas, before you say one word, take a look at that truck. I've got three tons of wheat seed on it, and I intend to plant my whole 160 acres with it. Well, good. And nobody better try and... What do you mean, good? <laughs> well, we hope you have a bumper crop. So you can stick me with the penalties. No, well, there ain't gonna be no penalties. Why, I thought that you... Darling, th was Mr. Haney drafted? No, ma'am, I'm just fighting the siege of green acres. <laughs> Lisa, the committee just told me I can plant all the wheat I want and no penalties. Oh, that's good. That's right. We heard from Washington. Aha, uh -huh. my petition did the trick. No, it was that balling out we got that did it. Yeah, the wheat penalties were abolished in 1963. <laughs> you didn't know about it? Well, we, uh, we haven't opened our mail lately. <laughs> lately? That's what the balling out was for. You mean to tell me I went through all that because you didn't open your mail? I could have gotten it. You want me to shoot them? <laughs> no. Only cost you two dollars a piece. <laughs> Please, will you unload the truck? Well, uh, we'll be running along. Uh, Wally, do you mind? I'll say when we'll be running along. I'm the chairman. So we'll be running along. Darling, is everything all right with the wheat? It certainly is. Thanks for watching. If you want to see more videos, hit the subscribe button. If you like the video, hit the like button. If you have something